it can be really frustrating to feel misunderstood. So this tapping session is here for you to help you feel a bit more understood. Tapping on the back side of the hand, deep breath into your belly, exhaling with a sigh, give your body a little shake and repeating back after me. I've been feeling really misunderstood. Between the eyebrows. Feeling really misunderstood. Tapping onto the eye, the side of the eyes. I love and accept myself. Even though I don't feel understood. Tapping under the eyes. I am bringing so much compassion and gentleness to the part of me that wants to feel understood. Tapping under the nose. Communicating can be really frustrating and difficult sometimes. Tapping under the lips. I'm choosing to love and support myself. As I improve my communication skills, tapping to the chest. I just want you to know that tapping can bring up a lot of uh, things, so please stay with me for this journey. My practice is to really acknowledge some of the negative thoughts that are probably there underneath the surface in your mind, which can bring up things, but please stay with me. This really, really works. I've been doing this for over 13 years. You're in good hands. Tapping down to the front of the ribs. I really want to feel understood to the side of the body. And I just feel so powerless in this situation. I don't know how to make them understand me. To the wrist, and it's really frustrating. And I feel really alone when I'm not understood. To the back side of the hand. So I am being extra kind and loving with myself. Choosing to love and accept myself, especially in moments where I don't feel understood. Deep breath. (sighs) Tapping up to the top of the head. I love and accept myself. Between the eyebrows. And I'm acknowledging how frustrating it is to feel misunderstood sometimes. to the sides of the eyes. And I'm open to the possibility that as I love and support myself under the eyes, as I relax and I'm gentle with myself under the nose, and my whole nervous system calms down under the lips. And I'm able to access more of my brain And I am able to communicate more effectively. Tapping to the chest. And I love and completely forgive myself for getting triggered sometimes. Tapping to the front of the ribs. I completely forgive myself for my reactions. Tapping to the side of the body. I know it doesn't help them understand me. But I just get so frustrated. <laughs> so there is. I'm choosing to slow down and be gentle and loving with myself, giving myself all the support and understanding that I need. in order for the other person to understand me. Tapping to the back side of the hand. And I'm choosing to be compassionate with myself. Because no one taught me how to communicate like this. There weren't lessons in school around how to understand someone and how to feel understood. Tapping up to the top of the head. It probably would have been better than trigonometry, right? (laughs) So I'm choosing to be gentle and loving with myself. As I figure out how to help the other person understand me. 
lifting the eyebrows and I know the more loving and supportive I am with myself the easier it is for other people to understand me to the sides of the eyes the more I'm giving myself love and understanding the more space I feel tapping under the eyes and the easier it is to reach a place of understanding. Deep breath. <sighs> Tapping under the nose. And I am ready to be a little bit more vulnerable. Under the lips. A little bit more authentic. Tap into the chest. As this will probably also help the other person understand me. and understand where I'm coming from. And I only need to do this in moments where it feels safe. Tap into the front of the ribs. I am choosing to love and support myself, especially when I don't feel understood. This side of the body. And I am learning how to communicate in a way where I feel more understood. Tapping to the wrist. When I'm giving myself love, it's easier for me to give other people love and patience. And that creates an environment of understanding. Tap into the back side of the hand. And I completely forgive myself for all the times I got triggered and reactive. I'm choosing to let those old experiences go now. Taking a deep breath and just let them go. Good job. Thanks for still being here. We're almost done. Tapping up to the top of the head. And I'm learning how to slow down and create safety inside of myself so that I can communicate what I need in order to feel understood between the eyebrows. And I'm learning that it's safe for me to say to someone else, I'd love to feel more understood. Do the sides of the eyes. Would you be willing to listen to me for three minutes without interrupting? Just listen to me and then repeat back afterwards what you heard. Tapping under the eyes. And I'll let you know if you missed anything. Having under the nose, it would really help me feel understood. Tapping under the lips. And then I can do the same for you. Because I'd really love to understand you. Tapping to the chest. So that is a little uh, authentic relationships, uh, authentic relating uh, exercise that you can do with someone. But essentially, you can also just ask someone, hey, I'd really love to feel understood by you. Can, uh, can you listen to me for a few minutes and then just repeat back what you hear? You're allowed to ask for that. <laughs> so taking a big deep breath and say out loud, I'm starting to feel more understood. And I'm giving myself all the understanding that I need in order to feel safe. Beautiful, amazing work. Please leave me a little comment down below. How are you feeling? Even just a few emojis, it means so much to me. Honestly, your comments light me up and really inspire me to create more of these videos. And I have a five day free tapping challenge that you can sign up to. So you get a video like this every day for five days to really 
um, practice EFT and self-love in the, in the way that I do EFT. And I guide people on deeply transformative one-on-one -on -one journeys. So what I can do on YouTube is just like a little taster. But when I work with you one-on-one, -on -one, I can really dive into the past and look at the different times in your life when you weren't feeling understood and we can really like rewire your brain and let go of those old experiences to create a feeling of being understood, of being lovable, of being loved. And one of my like specialities is really around communication, relationships, boundaries. So it is a joy to guide people on these topics, especially. So there's information down below if you're interested in that. And I have an online EFT course as well, which you can sign up for and learn how to use EFT tapping by yourself, create your own scripts and guide yourself. So, and also come back to this video and there's over 130 other videos on my channel. So check them out, other little EFT tapping sessions like this. And until next time, remember that every single part of you is worthy of love.